Hello everyone, in this video I will be set up IPsec Remote Access VPN to connect user devices to internal networks securely. IPsec is a widely used protocol for secure communication over the internet. It provides a framework for encryption and authentication data to ensure the confidentiality, integrity and authenticity of network traffic. In the context of remote access VPN, IPsec is often used to establish a secure tunnel between a client device and remote network, enable secure access to network resources. There are several options available for configuring IPsec based remote access VPNs on a FortiGate firewall, each with its own set of advantages and limitations. The most common option is pre-shared key. At the first, I have to create a user, click on user definition, click on create new, select local user as a default, click next, give the username and password. Click next, don't enable two-factor authentication. Create a user group for the IPsec VPN user. As you can see, I don't have and I create a new group. Give the name of this group and select the type of firewall. Because I don't have any member yet, I don't want anyone to put him in this group. Click on close, submit. Now it's time to set up IPsec. But uh, before that, I have to create an interface for test purpose. Click on interface on the network menu, create a new interface. Create a loopback interface here, write the name, select loopback interface, give the IP address for test purpose, enable ping and click on OK. Now I'm, to, I'm continuing to create a remote access VPN, click on IPsec wizard. Give the name, that's not accepted, again, okay that's enough, type remote access, as you can see it shows us the options and also you can install for the client on PC and tablet. Also, it's available for Cisco client. Click on for the client. Next. Incoming interface is your WAN interface. Give the pre-shared key. You will be used in the VPN client configuration. Select your user group. Click next. Local interface is our network resources that will allow to access from the remote device and also give the IP address of that interface. Client range address is something like the DHCP server that our client when connected to this FortiGate will be assigned to them. Click on next. You can change these options. Next and create okay automatically our tunnel will be up and also policy will be available on the policy firewall policy 
as you can see because automatically created service selected as all you can change that and you can see the source and destination IP addresses you can also enable security profile for this connection I'm enabling all session log click on OK now I'm going to test this connection. I start ping to this firewall loopback IP address. As you can see, I don't have any access to this IP address. This is loopback interface IP address. Okay. Configure VPN. Select IPsec VPN from this menu, give the connection name. Test IPsec VPN. Remote gateway is our WAN IP address. As you can see, because this test purpose, I use local IP address. In the pre-shared key, I write the key. Click on save. Okay. Provide the username and password. Click on connect. Let me check the ping. Okay. As you can see, I have access to firewall loopback IP address. Now check the VPN status. IPsec tunnel. Yes, as you can see that's up. Also you can check the details from here. I hope this video will be useful for you. And if you want to see another video, you can subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to ask any question in the comments. Also, as you can see, we can change the configuration of these settings. Have a good day. Bye bye.